the morning brew with friends. We got our buddy Alex Parama with us this morning, and you brought on a special friend. Yes, Aaron. Aaron, Aaron Bent is here. She's going to be playing for us in just a little bit. Welcome back, Aaron. Thanks. And we were just talking. This weekend was fun because you yeah. guys had the Ciclovia. That's right. And it was the bicycle from Civic Plaza to your spot at the rail yards yeah, it was event. Amazing, and we saw a huge bump at our bike valley. And I oh, good. To know that and you were you were valley. put on bike valley I was duty. On bike valley du duty, and I have to report I didn't lose one bike. Awesome. So we're good. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> so no, we do want to encourage that even beyond Ciclovia for mm -hmm. people to use alternate forms of transportation. Bike, skateboard, you know, the mass transit system is getting better here as well. So right. we're excited. It's great. Well, I went to the Ciclovia thing at Civic Plaza. And then, yeah. I, and then I drove to your spot. Like, All I was right. kind of lazy and just hopped but in the car. you did a little bit. I did a little bit. Yeah. But you know, people were telling me, there weren't really many people on Civic Plaza. And I was yeah. like, are you kidding? Because when I were there, there was a constant turnover of people. Right. It seems like right. everybody, they weren't using the Civic Plaza as a place to hang out. They were using it as a place to meet up. Yeah. And then every like half hour, that the whole crowd would turn over, and then people would, I think would ride That's their bikes cool. over to your place, and right? Since you were there, and I was over at Rail Yards, uh, there were artists there and booths set up, right? Right. It's yeah. Pretty it was cool. great. Well, it was all part of the 24 hours work. That's which right. Was last right. And I can't yeah. wait to see what happens again next year. Yeah. With that, yeah, those guys did a bang up job. Right. Mm -hmm. But just because that big event happened doesn't mean you guys stop having no, big we're events. We're still doing our thing. Is it bouquet fashion? fashion? No. What is that? Like bouquet that, fashion. You know, that, it, like... that was inspired last year. I think last year, correct me if I'm wrong, we had our first fashion week in New Mexico, right. Albuquerque or something like right. that. Right, so Bur Burke fashion, yeah. I think of as like, you know, a khaki suit and lokes. Yeah. Is that is that right? <laughs> you know, that's what people think, but we, we encourage you to use your imagination. Come on, dress up in your best Burke style. You could be from the South Valley or the Northeast Heights. It all depends, but, you know, right. just use whatever creative... Uh, imagination you have and come on down. And are you going to have like a red carpet and fashion show in the whole nine yards? Yeah, well, you know, I'm going to take some chalk, red chalk. And <laughs> I'm going to do that. That's, that's real you yards. You hold me to that, Aaron. Yeah. I'm gonna... that's, that's real yard style. That's right. Is doing yeah. DIY. That's right. DIY that's the, the whole red carpet, thrust of right? the whole thing, right? You know, we all put this together, a bunch of volunteers, and here we are, year two. I love Getting it. close to finishing year two. That's yeah. hard to believe. I know, time flies. Right? Yeah. It seems like just yesterday you guys were just brand new and opening and everything yeah. else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love it. So the Berkey fashion is part of this thing next week. Right. And But right now there's a lot of gardeners and uh, local farmers that have a That's bunch right. of stuff, right? You know, we're getting, you know, uh, we're getting so many new things that there with you know cucumbers and tomatoes last week had foodscapes and right. there's so much stuff well, going there, on. I was Abundance, noticing I guess is the word. Uh, last week the I guess you call them the, the harder vegetables the radishes mm -hmm. and the squashes were coming in there was some beautiful but butternut yeah, squ yeah, squash yeah. last week there. Just in time for Halloween. Right yeah it'll be great. So come on down for sure definitely and we'll also be having hat, hat making at the children's zone and Caustic Threads is going to be there, you know, showing off the, some of their techniques and making t shirts. And of course, 111 Media is always there with their t-shirts. So. I love those guys. Cause yeah. The 111 Media guys, for those, if you haven't been to the rail yards, the 111 Media guys are there and they, they take this mobile screen printing kit yeah, with them. Beautiful. And it's the coolest thing because you can just show up, you pick your t-shirt, you pick your design, and they screen print it right there right. for you. And they even welcome original designs. I mean, if you yeah. have something, draw it and come down and James will do it. He will turn it into a that's right a screen print for that's you right. and yeah. make your own shirt. You can do stuff with your own with your business with whatever you want with your kids' art, whatever you want yeah, to do, which is great a, fun. A, a, you know, a picture of Dan right here if you want. To right, hear it, it would be around. the best, I think. <laughs> yeah, that's the morning brew shirt. We should. Yeah. Have, we need to get some of those done. Let's do it. We should. I'll talk to we'll, James today. We'll make that happen. Okay. Absolutely. And we've so, got our friend Aaron here. And Aaron, you've got some news about your new CD. Am I right? Did it just win a uh, New Mexico Music Award? Yeah, yeah. They uh, take place at the end of May every year, and it was a four-time nominee, and it won for Best Adult Contemporary Song, which I was surprised by, and mm -hmm. yeah, that was that's great. great. <laughs> yeah. That's very cool. So remind us, I've got the new CD. We set it here somewhere. Yeah, that's there Firefly is. right there. Right it here. It's a full 10 piece band. And it is on iTunes and Amazon, and you can stream it on Spotify. And I sell it whenever I play all around Albuquerque. Selling it out of the trunk of the car. And you can find, yeah, I have it on my person case. at all times. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, like, just give me 10 bucks, I'll give you one of these. Yes, that yep. Yeah, mm -hmm. That's 10 bucks. perfect. That's it.
That's go. perfect. Well, and you're going to play a song for us today. Yes, from I am. From the CD? This is actually a newer song. Oh. Yeah. For something you're working on for the next CD? Yeah. This is exactly. an exclusive, Dan. This is, we this love is this. Premiere, exclusive. Yeah. Is, the, is this a world premiere? Can <laughs> we say that? Premiere. There you go. Okay, awesome. <laughs> All right, here we go. Sometimes I try so hard Only to feel lost again Start Lessons to learn Do us, do us a pay That finish line seems to far away But even so, carry on Performing at the rail yards on Sunday the 27th. Yes, that's it is Berkey fashion, so I will that's come right. in my best Berkey fashion. You your best I'll find fashion. something fashionable. Yeah. And then you, you see the Firefly by Aaron Bent, pick it up in her trunk, on her person, yeah, out of her I, guitar I, case, I yeah. wherever you can find it, and on iTunes. We'll be back in a couple of seconds on the Morning Brew.